Good morning, folks. I have to come on here for a minute and just tell you that I'm very sorry that that video put up by Gary Larrabee that I shared with you about Queen Elizabeth dying, which, of course, he got it from the video that I let you hear a little portion of. But several of you uh, said it was a hoax. Well, when I went on Facebook, um, now I don't remember which one of you it was, one of you fellas said you'd searched all the international sites you knew of, and there was nothing mentioned about the Queen dying, and which I had already taken it down, but I was glad because then I saw your post, and then I felt better about it, because sometimes I think, well, am I letting people, you know, direct my channel? What if they're wrong? And the other half, you know, needed it. You know, I'm like, oh, Lord, help me with this, you know, because when I heard that, after after seeing that, um, oh, Diana's, I think it was Diana, that I put up her vi dreams earlier yesterday, and she said, after the queen dies, I think that's the name. She said, after the queen dies, something will happen in three days or something. And then that came out. I mean, isn't that weird? That she would have that dream, and then somebody would just happen to be posting that yesterday? I just find that very odd. I'm not saying she really did die. Because surely more sites, you know, internationally would have known it. If they supposedly let out an official release from the palace. As that man had said. The original channel. I mean. I just, you know, I'm like. Lord, what is going on? Why would somebody choose to put that out? They surely didn't know that Diana had that dream and that before. Could they? Satan knows a lot of things, though. Not as much as God, but he has his demons. He has his demons everywhere. And they, of course, report back to the fallen angels who report back to Satan. It's just like an army. You know, they have their ranks. And he has his spies. He has his spies trying to figure out what we're doing all the time. I apologize for getting everybody excited or upset, either way. But I thought it was a reliable source, and it just seemed right. I felt, I mean, I was like, you know, like when you get that, the Holy Spirit comes upon you, and you feel, maybe it was a human emotion, but it, I just felt like it was right in my spirit. You know, people have said she died already and there's a clone taking her place anyway. Or some body double. I kind of believe that. And that they just finally came out and said she died. So Prince Harry, is it? Prince Charles? Oh, whichever one it is. Prince William? is going to finally take over and be the king. That's what I thought. He's already been given the position. He's been, like, not knighted, but they, I saw the ceremony on a YouTube video, like, over a year ago, where she passed on the power and the throne to him for when she dies. And I figured, well, for some reason, the time is right. 
to pass the power on to him. But if it's a hoax, I mean, it looks like it is because nobody else is reporting it. So if anybody hears any of this from an outside the United States international type site, like, you know, a news channel, let us know, okay? Let us know, and I will repost that video. All right. So I'm really sorry about that, and I don't know what else to say. Please forgive me for that, okay? I plead the blood of Jesus over this video, over the Internet connection, and over all of you as well. And let us keep praying for California. I don't, I haven't found an update on that yet. I will do that next. Um, so far, I heard this morning, it, the dam did not break. But evacuations are still underway from what I have read. Okay, I need to find a update, a good update on that. Okay. I will talk to you later. Okay, bye-bye for now. God bless you all. May he be with us and have mercy on our loved ones. That's what I pray. Have mercy on us all. Amen.